days to come. Yeah, I completely forgot I brought the vlog camera with us. Uh, we are spending the morning at the beach. It's actually um, our homeschool day. However, um, the kids were just like really tired from the weekend. I think they were anticipating the Easter Bunny and stayed up late and then got up really early, like seeing if the Easter Bunny came. And, no, we didn't. and I just, you did not? Lyndall said she like didn't sleep at all. Yeah. She couldn't so, sleep. Like Lyndall went and rested on her own yesterday and then last night I tried to get them down for bed early but then some stuff went down after bedtime so everybody was up later. So anyway, um, I just really didn't want to wake them up this morning. Yeah, Wee Wee. Great. We're getting ready to leave so of course Eloise is completely buried in the sand. So anyway, instead of going to our homeschool co-op today, we are doing homeschool at the beach. And we've spent the whole morning here and it's been awesome. We went to a different part of Fernandina Beach than we went to the previous couple of times. And it's really, it's a really nice beach. There's so many seashells. The sand, it's so interesting. It's like, the sand is, instead of being really fine sand, it's like little seashells. So. And we've got our magnifying glasses, we've got our bug kits, and we have we have just been playing in the water, exploring the sand, going for walks down the beach. There is a nice little like, restaurant right over there. I think we're gonna grab lunch and then head back home, see what the babies are doing. They'll be napping by the time we get home, but yeah, it's been a great morning. We need to do this more often, for sure. It's like so nice today, that's the thing. This is the time of year that you want to go to the beach because it's not blazing hot. It's perfect. It's like probably low 70s, nice breeze. Hopefully you can hear me over the wind. It is toy rotation bin day. Isn't that wild? So once a month, or I'm sorry, once every three months we rotate the toy bins and we dump all these bins out. We probably have five of them. And then we fill them up with toys from the playroom and put them back in the attic. And we've actually been sticking to it every three months. And each time we do, it's like Christmas. It's awesome. Hey guys, did you have fun at the beach today? Yeah. Yeah? Cool. Alexa. I'm working on dinner right now. Um, I'm, I'm starting to use my Instant Pot a lot more. I think I've just like realized how easy stuff is in it. You basically just have like one pot for the whole recipe unless you do pasta on the side or something which actually I could, probably could have done pasta on the Instant Pot but anyway um, I'm making like this really easy chicken recipe and I did Brussels sprouts and pasta and then in the Instant Pot after you cook the chicken you make a sauce with what's left and it's gonna be good I think it's also April Fool's Day today and Brad found out on his way to work that he had duty today which is kind of not good because he's supposed to be there early when he has duty and he was not there early but you were only you were going to be really early for work but instead you were just a little bit late for duty is that right well i should be there at seven he should be there at seven so he really was on duty i was thinking when he told me that that he was just um april foolsing me because when he's on duty he's home late and I was like, he's going to say that he's on duty and then he is going to be home like on time and just walk in and be like, April Fool's. And then that time passed. I even had the kids like all ready to like April Fool's him back. Yeah. We were going to like hide in the house, which we ended up doing anyway. But hey, how do I put this on? Hey, mommy. What's going on around here? We have a surprise. <laughs> Uh, Eloise, can you pause that, please? Um, do you have any guesses of what this is? No. No, no guess. Not even a single guess? Not even a single guess. What is it? What Hmm. What is it, Bear? Did you get shark? Shark? Let's see what its name. Linda, what what animal did you get? <laughs> His name? Oh, 
You got a sloth? No way. I got a dolphin. I, I really have we two. got a dolphin? Wait, two O's. So it's ooh. Daddy, I got ooh. a dolphin. Yes. <laughs> boo. Boo the shark. You got, let's see, okay. the Sloth Meet Boo. Conservation Foundation. Boo Meet Female. Calypso. My name's Calypso. Cute. Mommy, my name's Calypso. Oh Eloise, what's your name? Hey, there's a person, there's a dog on Bluey named Calypso. Yeah, exactly. He's a hammerhead. FIU, Marine Conservation my Ecology my Lab. Sloth name's what's his name? Meet. Per. P E R. Per. Per. Pear? Pear? You think pear? Wouldn't that be P E A R? This is per like person? Per. Per is a male bottlenose dolphin. There it is. Cool. Okay, so what do you do? Talk me through this. You scan a QR code. Okay. And then tap to rescan. I got a bad scan. Oh, you're now tracking Boo. And then we can see, oh my gosh, Boo, Boo is not far away from us. Seriously? Yeah, so Boo, well, is in like the Caribbean. Is it the oh Caribbean or the Caribbean? Mommy, how far well, is Introducing 3D maps. Place a finger in each circle and drag up. My Oh. A finger in each circle. <gasps> we can see how deep Boo is. Oh yeah. I think. So then it tells you about your animal. So we've got Boo. Um, and mommy, how, how about my dolphin? I got them. Okay. I need your phone. You just got them like oh, a wait, week ago. I have the app. Don't we I? did. Didn't you? April. Yeah. Yes. Didn't you order them when you were in Missouri? So how'd you find out about this? I did. Um, my aunt Nancy got us all friendship bracelets. Yeah. So for the kids too. Yeah. But you got the adults, the ones with the animals, the tracking. It's yeah. called Follow. F A H L O. So you, um, your bracelet is attached to an animal. Like I have a giraffe. Larry has a lion. And Brooke has a giraffe. I mean, Brooke has an elephant. Ooh, what is Ellie's? What is? Lola's line is like in between Brooke's elephant and mommy's drink. Yeah, she's like gonna eat them. <laughs> Wait, did I tell them what mama has. She mama has a polar bear that has a dog. Her I name asked, is asked. Aurora. Aurora the polar bear? Like where, Aurora polar what, bear. What? Okay, nobody else answered. Where is Aurora? Is she on land? No, she's in the water. She's been in the water since December 8th. So it's, it's really cool and like all this supports the wildlife, the wildlife foundation or something. And it's not Marine conservation expensive, right? Lab. No. So they're like, I can't, I don't it's know. It's like 16 sure. bucks. 16 bucks. Yeah, yeah, pretty yeah, cheap. So, yeah, we can link them below. They're definitely a good cause and also like really cool to be able to. What? Which one did so mommy like bear, get again? Bear oh, yeah, shark is in the Caribbean, but you can see where all it's been. Wow. And like where it was, there's a fin. Where it was when they originally started Mommy. tracking it, January 15th. On my birthday. And look where all it's been since then. Wow. Where's my dolphin? Boy? That's actually a lot. This is neat. Do you a dolphin? I got It's a been 516 lot. miles since they started tracking it. That's a lot. Its biggest threat dolphin. is bycatch, so accidentally getting caught, I guess. A great hammerhead shark measured 295 feet. Is it a dolphin? She was found in the Bahamas at 30 feet below. It's a she. Mommy. She. It's a girl. Oh, Boo. Her name's Boo. <laughs> hey, just like uh, monsters. Monsters Inc. What's my name again? Okay, this girl one. Boo. Yeah, we'll take it all. We'll do it in just a second. Let's all right. scan mine. What all right. is this? I need your card. I need the card. That She's traveled. <laughs> what? What? Since her last location, she's traveled 0.0, .0 feet. And her total distance is 0. 0.9 miles. <laughs> yeah, this is this is the sloth, right? How much her is average that? speed is a half of a foot per hour. <laughs> I, I was curious about why, why the heck would you track a sloth? I want to see. Yeah. 
Okay, so what she's actually been wow. quite a ways. Yeah. yeah. Oh my god, yeah. yeah. I can travel all without water. But look how slow she's traveled like since April. Like all of these days, she just like it's barely moving. <laughs> yeah. Wow, look at the map. You can see like there's a house right there. Whoa. She's wow. near some housing. That's crazy. And she is my in... Mommy now. Is she in Costa Rica? It looks like We summer. should go visit her. Yeah. Yeah, great idea. Yeah, I want to. Yeah. Wouldn't that be fun? Yeah. And I can wear this on the way. I can definitely wear this. Yeah, I'm going to It's supposed to hang upside down. It's supposed to hang upside down. Oh, I'm sure you do. Yeah. I love my No, I don't know if anybody has a dolphin weeby. Yeah, she is in Costa Rica. Yeah, awesome. Yeah. Yeah, we can visit. We can yeah. Perfect. Conservation Ecology Lab is that Florida? Yeah. Oh look! I would say that's pear. That's she's in really she's in Florida. She's right off the coast of Florida. <gasps> we can visit her too. Definitely. Yeah, yeah. yeah definitely. I literally have never seen a dolphin. We went like, to Florida. She's traveled 152 miles. Wow! Yeah. Has she traveled more? Than Mine her hasn't traveled. Her average speed is 3.8 miles per hour. That's cool. Mine's a half of a foot. <laughs> <laughs> And her average speed is 0. 0.0 <laughs> feet per hour. Like this? Not even miles per hour, feet per hour. Yeah. Like this? Not even one foot. Exactly, little. Yeah. <laughs> you might be moving too fast. Like... You, might, you need to slow down. Her weight, Eloise, pair or purse weight is, oh, it's a boy. A oh. male bottlenose dolphin. And mine a girl. girl. Is mine a girl? Um, she's 555 pounds. Mine's a girl? Yes, mine girl. a girl. No, it's a boy. Which is it? How much is mine? Mine's my girl. Um, let me check. I can't remember. Mine has little girl. Calypso sounds call. like a girl name. Yeah, it? it does. It definitely does. She's a teacher on Bluey and she's a girl, girl, girl boy. Yep, she's a mom too. Oh, oh. I've got a mom? She has a baby. Yeah. I wonder if mine has a baby. Um, it will probably. She's a three-fingered sloth and is, is as spirited as they come. <laughs> mine, is, mine is a kid. Uh, mine a kid. This mine a kid. Wait, wait, yours is a boy. This chill mom is also nurturing an adorable okay. baby, offering a unique glimpse into sloth's What's maternal behaviors. This I don't know. It doesn't say what the baby's name is. Maybe you can just you can just name it. Name it. Visit her. So these are a lot closer than the last. Coming. She's an yeah. all cow. Coming. She's an all cow. <laughs> she's not far. We live here, and she's right over here. Where's FIU? I don't know. Who's FIU? That's the college. Where's you? I'll have to look it up. Florida International Institute University. <laughs> Okay, time to go to sleep, everybody. I know it's going to be hard. Yeah, no joke. Can we visit my dolphin tomorrow? <laughs> I wish. Can we get the scissors? Did you get the scissors? Let's see. Yeah. FIU. That's in Pakistan. Florida International. It's in Miami. Florida International. You get one. University? Yep. Yeah. 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 But I just can't. I can't wear that with my uniform on, and I wear my uniform every day. All right.